hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel and welcome to my giant collective haul i have so many cute things to show you guys i went ahead and splurged because i was just in that type of mood so if you guys want to see what i got definitely continue watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe let's go ahead and jump into the first bag so i actually took quite a few trips to the stores i didn't get this all at once i just kept getting lucky so yeah i also have a little bath and body works haul that i'm gonna do at the end to start off let me show you guys what i got from burlington so the first thing that i got that i kind of already opened because i wanted to see like if it would work for what i needed it to work for is this stepping stool that i got from burlington it is a juicy couture stepping stool and i already ripped this off but it was 6.99 and it is so cute and it is perfect and exactly what i needed i have a part of my closet that i can't reach without a stepping stool so i needed one because the one that i have is broken and dusty and crusty so i went ahead and got a pink juicy couture one because what what could be better than that so i got that and then i also picked up this juicy couture makeup bag set this was 16.99 and i love the colors so it has orange this like lilac purple and then pink i really like this set i think this is the perfect set for me because these little bags are going to be perfect for my little what's in my bag videos so this is the first one it's like this really nice orange it has pink hearts purple jc and yellow crowns the next one which is the one that i think i like the most is this purple iridescent one so cute and then the last one oops the last one that i got is this pink one and it says juicy on it so cute and then it also has of course the clear bag with the juicy on the front so cute as soon as i saw it i knew i was gonna get it i actually went back on my no purchasing makeup bags this year because i actually went through all my makeup bags and i realized i actually don't have that that many and i also gave some away so yeah i went ahead and got it okay so next we're gonna get into marshall's which i got a lot of stuff from marshall's so this is what i got on one of my trips to marshall's i don't know if it was the first second i know it wasn't the third because i didn't get it today so i did get some cute house shoes look at these little house shoes and they're so cute and furry these were 9.99 and of course i love this color and it also matches my little stepping stool that i picked up and these are actually by jessica simpson which i didn't even realize until just now but i thought these were so cute and when i tried them on they were the perfect fit this let me see oh there we go okay there we go there we go so yeah i got a size medium and they fit perfectly so got that the next thing that i got which ugh, so cute when i saw this i was so happy look at this little steve madden wristlet so cute this was for 16.99 and it has a little pocket here and then it has this big pouch and the big pouch does have some card slots on this side i love this color this color is so pretty the little bubblegum pink like are you kidding me stop so i went ahead and picked that up 16.99 and then i got some nails so i've been actually needing some more press on nails because my press on nail drawer was looking really dry so i went ahead and picked these up and then i realized that they're actually the stick on press ons and not the ones that you glue on so i'm not i'm not that happy about it but these are really really pretty i especially love the green ones because i have some dunks that's like emerald green like that that these are gonna look so cute with and then these will just go with anything and these were 4.99 each the next thing that i picked up that is so cute is this little compact mirror organizer and it was 5.99 if you guys can see and and it opens up like this and has like a little storage compartment with the mirror so cute for my what's in my bag videos and i also really love the color it's like a almost pinkish but it's actually like a lilac color it's kind of not picking it up on camera as well but yeah it's a really pretty color and i love the bling like stop this. it's just so cute and it was and it was only 5.99 the last thing in this bag is this lemon candle that i cannot wait to put in my kitchen this smells amazing i'm in love with lemon scented things for the kitchen and i've been burning lemon cello and this candle is like lemon cello 
but way sugarier sugarier more sh i should just say way more sugary it literally smells like a lemon head that you know the lemon head candy it that's what it smells like it smells amazing i had to get this i didn't even care about the price how much was this 14.99 i've never spent 14.99 on a candle at marshall's but this yeah and the top of it looks like a little sliced lemon so after you're done with the candle you can use this as a cute little jar just so cute okay so i got that and that's everything in that bag i actually picked up one thing from ross and i'm gonna show you guys real quick i went to ross and i was getting stuff for the house and then i saw this and i was just like okay okay you can get it you can get it look how cute this little makeup bag is and it was only $6.99 look at the little zipper pull it has a little flower on it I thought this was so cute did I need it no but did I want it yes so don't judge me please this is gonna be so cute for my what's in my bag videos I just I love this so much I just love this color it kind of matches the wristlet it is like the same exact color as the wristlet that I got. And I got more stuff in this color that I cannot wait to show you guys. So I got that. So cute. And then, I'm actually, I think I saved, I'll save the bags for the last. I'm going to save the bags for last. So I actually picked up this Hello Kitty mirror that I already took out and put in my bag. And I don't feel like going to get. But it's this one right here. The, the pink one and it was $19.99 I already been using this I could not wait I literally couldn't wait I threw the box back in the bag so I intended on putting it back in the box so I could show y'all but I was just too eager to use it so yeah got that and then I did pick up just a few makeup goodies just a few so the first thing that I picked up is this beauty creation sweet dose lip care combo and it and it has a lip scrub and a lip oil and it is watermelon scented i actually already have this lip oil and i'm almost done with it because i love this scent and i love their lip oil i've actually been falling in love with beauty creation stuff so i got this one and this was only 6.99 and then i also picked up the peach one which i actually haven't tried yet and this was also for 6.99 which i thought was a good deal because i've actually been to the beauty creation store and i believe that these by itself is like five dollars so to get the lip scrub and the lip oil for 6.99 i thought that was a really good deal and yeah so i picked these up so i picked up those and then i picked up one more thing from beauty creations which i'm so excited about so i found the nude x full palette because I picked up a small one in a couple hauls ago or actually I think it was in my last haul so this is the one that I'm wearing on my eyes today they had other nine pan palettes there from beauty creations from this line but I didn't pick those ones up because I saw this one and this has everything that I could possibly need I've been in love with beauty creations like I said lately so I was very happy to find this full size palette it's gorgeous okay let me stop talking and just show you guys this palette is so pretty look how pretty this palette is and it's just right up my alley i love that it has a black that i can use as like a little fake winged eyeliner moment all the neutrals it has a few pops of pink the shimmers just everything i need everything i need and i'm not even buying eyeshadow palettes this year but i don't know something about this beauty creations nude x line that's just been speaking to me so i made an exception because like i couldn't pass this up especially not for 9.99 you know and the last three things in this bag are these nails i actually have them on right now i don't use the little silver ones i thought this color was so cute and i actually went to the nail shop and got this same exact color on my feet i love when my feet and my nails match so i definitely want to keep that going and just redo my nails the same color so i was very happy to find these and not only did i find so many packs of them i found them on clearance for four dollars so i grabbed three because why not and they last because i've had this set on for um, some time and they they looking crusty dusty it's time for me to refresh okay next for this bag is only one thing but i got so lucky i found this pink sugar set on clearance for 13 dollars. i have never seen pink sugar for 13 dollars before so i went ahead and grabbed it it comes with the shower gel the perfume and the body cream and it was 13 dollars. can you believe that because i i was literally shocked when i saw this and this was the only one that was marked at 13 dollars. i don't know if that was a mistake or what but the other ones were marked down to 16 dollars. so i saved the cute little three dollars i'm so happy about this i actually have not owned pink sugar in years like actual literal years 
I kind of forgot what it even smells like, to be honest. Such a pretty girly, spun, sugary type of scent. Love it. It's 1.7 fluid ounces, so you know you can kind of throw it in your bag if you got a big enough bag. And for my second to last Marshalls haul, I picked up not one, not even two, but three new bags because I just couldn't stop myself. I just couldn't help myself. So the first bag that I got is this cute little Steve Madden bag. I've been playing with it, so it's not in its best, you know? Let's go ahead and make it look cute for the camera. So this is what it looks like. It's this like scrunched pouch looking purse and the handle is braided and it does have a cross body strap that is tucked inside of the bag right now that looks like this. I thought this was so cute for $24.99. Yeah, it's like a black denim and you know denim bags are eating the girls up right now. So I did pick this up and I think this is from the same collection as that last bag that I picked up in my last haul with the big denim flower on it that I'm absolutely in love with. So I went ahead and picked her up. So cute. And that one was $24.99. Okay, and then along with that, I picked up this denim tote. Look at this. This one, this one was 40, but look how cute she is. And it comes with this little pouch. Like, how, how was I gonna leave this at the store? It was just not gonna happen. Cause this is so cute. Look at her, just so cute. This one, I can, I could not help myself. This is what it, this is what it looks like in the inside. It has these little pouches here, and it does have a little zipper on this side as well. It's so spacious, like you can fit your whole entire life in this bag. <sighs> so cute. Steve is really doing his thing with these bags. So all the bags that I picked up were from Steve Madden. So yeah i was really hoping to find the juicy couture bowler bag the hot pink like velour looking one i've been wanting that one since last year i can never find it and i have the perfect shoes to match i want that bag so bad so so bad but ah uh, if i find if i find it i find it at this point like i i'm not gonna hunt for it to be honest because i just don't have it in me to go hunting i just don't because i feel like it's just become so popular to find and resell for a ridiculous price and then it just takes the fun out of it you know what i mean but some people just really want the cute bag like just let me go find the cute bag at marshall's for 34.99 i'm not paying 100 dollars plus for that bag stop no absolutely not happening but anyway on a brighter note i did find which i, I haven't seen i literally have not seen anybody find this bag I can't even believe that I found this bag. Before I show you guys this bag, just know that I found this at a whole separate trip before I even came across this bag that I'm about to show you guys. But I have no regrets, so. But here she is, you guys. Look at her. She is so cute. This is a mesh tote from Steve Madden, and it comes with the wallet. The wallet comes with the bag, and it also comes with a little cosmetic pouch in the inside. Mine has a little spot on it that I did not notice until just now, but it's fine. I don't even care. So it's mesh, so it is kind of like, you know, see-through, which I love because I love my little see-through bags, especially for the spring and the summer. I could not believe I found this because I feel like if somebody would have walked in and saw this bag, they would have snatched it up so fast, just the same way I did. So it was just the luck of the draw that I was able to walk in and find it. And I only, not only did I find this one, I found them in every single color. So I did grab one for my mom, of course, cause she, she, I FaceTimed her and showed her and she wanted one. And this, and this set was only $40. Comes with the wallet, comes with the cosmetic pouch and the bag, $40. That's a good deal. Now, I am just a tad bit confused. Hopefully somebody can explain this to me because because the wallet actually has these little hooks on the back. So I'm like, are you supposed to wear this wallet as a purse as well? Like, is that an option or like, what is what is going on? What is happening here? Because the strap is actually removable. So I'm like, you wear the wallet? I don't know. I don't know. But this is but this is the inside of the wallet. It's so spacious. You have enough space for everything. A million card slots, like 
literally a million of them so definitely enough space and i know what you guys are probably thinking like okay so what are you gonna do with this and this i don't know but i'm gonna keep it i'm gonna keep it this one is not necessarily a wallet like it does have car spots in the back but this is more like a pouch and then this one is like a wallet so i'm just gonna have them both i got so lucky because i didn't even find these at the same time i found them separately and they just so happened to be a perfect match so yeah very happy about that this was probably like the highlight of my entire shopping trips with an s and since i did pick up the black one for my mom i'm just going to show you guys what the black one looks like because she is also super cute so this is the black one let me fix it because the wallet is all up when it should be down okay so this is what the black one looks like so cute and it does have the cosmetic pouch in the inside just like the pink one so cute i could not believe i found these when i say there was every color there was every color i was on facetime with my mom so i didn't get like a picture or a video or anything but trust me there was every single color there was purple yellow orange all of them i picked the pink one my mom picked the black one there was a white one she was torn between getting the white and the black she got the black and it is so cute so nice i cannot wait to do a what's in my bag video for for these because it's gonna be good okay and the last thing that i got from marshall's another mirror i know i know i've been loving mirrors okay i love mirrors especially a hello kitty mirror okay so i got this one this is the impressions led pocket mirror and this one has a little stand that pops out on the bottom Let me show you guys what it is so this is what it looks like and then you turn it on from the bottom i'm gonna turn it off and then in the back it has this little like ring that you can pull out and then you can like make it stand this is staying on my vanity with her big sister and that's gonna be so cute i'm so happy that i found this this was 24.99 which is a lot for a little mirror but yeah i was treating myself i was just treating myself okay i just let myself do whatever i wanted to do so yeah i'm so happy about this though it's gonna be so cute on my vanity i'm already reworking everything around her because she needs her own little spot i feel like i got so lucky because this is the type of stuff that i'll be looking for and don't never find i tried to set everything up so cute behind me and it is so cute right so this is everything that i got from marshall's ross and burlington so i'm editing and i completely forgot to show you guys this little two-piece set that i got it's so cute it's like a knitted little set and the shirt you can actually wear it either this way or you can wear it this way and then the pants are like see-through but they have little shorts underneath and i thought this outfit was so cute this set was $29.99 and it's from pink rose it's so cute i got it in a large hopefully this fits me nicely but i just wanted to mention this real quick because i left her out but back to the video i'm gonna show you guys what i got from bath and body works really quick and then we're gonna do a quick little five below haul and then we're gonna be done okay bath and body works had their i think it was 4.95 body hair or body lotion day i don't know what it was called but i went ahead and picked up a few things i actually ordered online for pickup in store so i only grabbed a few things i've already been using this this is their coco shea body butter i love this it smells so good I already started using this and I love it so I got that one and then I also picked up this sensitive skin um oatmeal body butter and it's the pink it's the pink one to the brown one basically um this one actually looks disgusting and unacceptable like you guys see that and that's that's literally how it came I haven't even used it yet but yeah I picked this one up and then I went ahead and picked up my Meet Me in Miami body lotion because I love this scent. This is Breezy Palm Trees, Cabana Coladas, and Suntan Days. I already have the Fine Fragrance Mist, so I've been waiting for a body care day so I could pick up the lotion. So I got that. And then I also picked up the Sweetheart Cherry body cream. Again, I already have the Fine Fragrance Mist. I love the Fine Fragrance Mist. I was waiting to buy the body cream. This is Wild Cherry, Crushed Pistachio, and Whipped Vanilla, and she smells it smells so good so different i love the packaging too it's so cute like if you have the cherry juicy couture bag and you have all the cherry sweetheart cherry stuff from bath and body where it's putting a cute little juicy couture cherry bag 
just all the cute cherry moments and then the last thing that i picked up is the brightest bloom perfume pen this is supposed to be a new scent and it smells amazing i love it it doesn't have the notes on here so i can't even tell you guys what the notes are but it smells so good i remember seeing jasmine and cedarwood on the on the notes listed but i don't remember all the notes but it smells so good i was like i might as well grab me a little perfume pen because it's new you know it was, and it was on sale for eight dollars because it was not out yet it was just the perfume pen so i went ahead and picked that up it smells so good <laughs> it smells so good it really did and that's everything that i got from bath and body work so now let's get into my quick little five below haul the first thing that i got is this strawberry plant pot so cute this was i think 555 and i think it's so cute i'm gonna put it in my living room and put a plant in it or something so cute the next thing i picked up is this cute little flower trash can i got this for my little vanity i'm put it under my desk and i actually put my last item inside so i'm gonna show y'all real quick i also picked up these hello kitty socks and i think these were like three dollars it only came with two pairs of socks but they're like mesh they're not like you know they're not like regular socks they're cool socks i'm just kidding but no cute little hello kitty socks and then this last item is not for me it's for my mom but it's the boba milk tea it's the kiropi boba milk tea she wanted to try it and it's their matcha flavor so i feel like that haul went by so fast but that is everything that i picked up in my giant collective girly haul i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next video